What's up guys, Carefree Llama here, and today we're going to start a new guide for finding all the mementos in Call of Duty World War II, and I'm going to separate them by mission, that way you don't have to watch a 30 minute video just to find that one memento you're missing. And today we're going to start with the D-Day mission, and we're going to continue and probably finish them all this week, so be sure to like this video and subscribe if you don't want to miss any of these videos coming out so you can find that one you are missing. First, after you storm the beach and get into the bunker area, uh, you're in the trenches here, there's a spot where you have to go prone or crouch through. The story wants you to turn left right after that. Instead, go straight, and you'll find the memento sitting here in this window. And then the second one is a little bit tricky, because as you're playing, uh, you're going to notice a door that's shut, and the memento is actually behind that. So what you're going to want to do is go clear bunker 3 of 5, and then instead of going to bunker 4, go back to that door, and it will be open, and you can get the next memento right there. And then this last memento is very out in the open as you're uh, having to clear the artillery. There's a, a farm with a stable right across from it. Go into the stable, go to the end of the stable. Memento number three. Again, not a long video, not a lot of explanation because really once you see where we're at on the map, it's very easy to find these things. They just might have been hidden from you if you weren't looking in the right spot. So these videos will help you find the right spot to look, which makes it easier to find these mementos and you can get that trophy or achievement whatever console you're playing on but thank you guys for watching and if you like this video again click that like button as always subscribe for more uh, call of duty content in the future because we're going to be putting out a lot of it